Welcome back to 13 on your side mornings. It's the first Sunday of the month and that means I'm joined now by the executive director of the NOAA project for our adopt a pet segment. Michelle, thank you for being with us this morning. Who is this very handsome boy you have with you? Um, this is Homestar. How long has he been with the shelter? How, how did he come to be with you guys? He came from Florida and he has been in two different shelters in Florida and through um, two different hurricanes. They actually had found him tied up to a tree and he had um, his collar had been embedded into his his neck and he got some medical treatment and then they reached out to us and knew that we would help them medically with them and we brought him in so he's been there almost a year he's been with you guys for almost mm -hmm. a year and I know that the hair really never grew back on yeah. his uh, neck but that really hasn't dampened his mm. spirit at all no he's got a great personality he's yeah. a great dog tell me a little bit more about his personality and his quirks he likes to go for walks, he likes to ride in the car, he likes to play with toys. Um, he's getting more familiar with water and little swimming pools. Um, he, he just enjoys being around people, so he really likes the attention. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hi. Oh, you want to come up here with me. Okay. Oh, you're so cute. I want to take him home. I do. So could Homestar go into a home with an existing animal? Yeah, with the right, we would set up some meet and greets to see how they got along, but he does do well with other animals with introductions. Yeah. Oh, I think he wants to come home with me. I think so. Oh my goodness. So, as far as those introductions work, how do, or how do they work really with another dog? Um, they, if they're interested in Homestar, they can come to Noah Project and then they would bring their pet with them and we would do some in introductions that way. Um, we would take them outside and introduce them and see how they do. Mm -hmm. It's a process, right? It takes it's patience, right? Mm -hmm. Especially when introducing like a new dog mm -hmm. to your home, especially a shelter pet. Yes. Right? Can you sure. tell us about just like what potential adopters, new par pet parents need to do when they're bringing home a shelter pet? Um, letting them get acclimated with their environment first and with them so they can get familiar with their surroundings and the people that live in the home and then slowly introduce them to other other people outside the home as, as they're getting acclimated to the home. Hello. Hello. Oh Hello. my goodness. I love him <laughs> so much. Um, all right, great. Could he go into a home with children, let's say? Um, he could. Yeah. He could go into a home with children, well, probably older children. He's an older dog, so he's he likes his naps and his, his downtime. Yeah. So I would suggest older children, yeah. In your mind, what does his forever home look like? Somebody who's home that has time to spend with him and work with him. And you know, he's never really been in a home. He's always lived in a shelter, so he needs, you know, to be trained to, you know, to live in a home and learn behaviors and things like that. And um, I think that that would be best for him, somebody who has the time to commit to him, somebody who is home more often than not. Right, so. someone who will go on nice long yeah. walks with him because yeah, he likes Homestar to is a little chunky. <laughs> he <is>. He's put <laughs> on a little extra weight at NOAA Project from all the bit. extra treats. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, he deserves it. Yeah. So tell me, where can people go to apply to adopt Homestar? They can go to our website um, at noahproject.org and they can come into NOAA Project as well to pick up on the application. And then the process takes about one to two days. Okay, yep. great. Uh, I love him so much, okay. and I would take him home in a heartbeat, but I, I'm going to have to consult Jingles first, that's for <laughs> sure. Uh, but you can also find more information about Homestar and the No Project on our website as well, 13onyourside.com.